Hey! Oh my gosh, literally, I... The lighting here is absolutely terrible. Um, so I did my little hair today. Um, and I haven't done my makeup, so, yes. Um, anyways, what are we doing today? We're in a new setting, new setting unblocked. Anyways, um, I think not, but if you've seen my vlogs, then you probably have seen my kitchen. Anyways, we are here today. I'm going to be making some food. I'm going to be showing you guys my famous recipe for um, atun, which is tuna. Yeah, so let's go. Let's go. Okay, since I have the camera already nice and set right here, this is where it, this is where you guys are gonna see me now because I was gonna put you guys down here so you guys can see the whole action, but I don't want to move it now because then it's gonna fall. I have my tripod too, but personally, I really like tuna, um, and I'm just gonna take you guys with me to make it. Um, yeah, but let's get started. Let's not talk too much because I'm getting hungry, so y'all let's go anyway so right here i have set my beautiful garlic i love garlic i love garlic it's absolutely delicious i i just think it's amazing um, okay so now that we're in a beautiful setting oh my gosh like this is a nice one because look i can go like this ah! okay now no okay so like i was saying oh Oh my god, this is so much. Like, look how long that took for me to get it set up. Anyways, so yes, we have our garlic right here. Oh my gosh, this is such a um, unflattering angle. Or maybe it's just me. I think it's probably just me. Um, it's just... Okay, so let me just continue. Okay, so I have my garlic here. And I would be showing you guys how I cut my stuff, but um, I'm not a good cutter, so I'm just gonna leave it at that. But anyways, um, I was gonna chop my little garlic into like tiny little bits, but I think I'm gonna probably keep them long this time. So now that my pan has been in there for way too long, I'm gonna add some olive oil. You can put whatever oil you like. I like olive oil. So just like that. And yes, now I have my garlic right here and I'm gonna get some onion. Those are like my two ingredients. I love, I love, hold up, let me get this onion. Then right here I have my beautiful onion. Um, you can use whatever kind of onion because there's like white and purple and I don't even know what else. But yeah, I just, I personally, I like white onion better. Um, purple onion is just like kind of strong. Um, but yeah, look at how beautiful she is. I used to hate onion. Like, I was like, the biggest, like, not really. I wouldn't say the biggest onion hater because I would still eat it in my like, tacos. Um, but I just didn't like onion. Like, I don't know. And then I started liking onion and I just like, it always has to be in my dishes. Like, she has to be there. She's a key ingredient. Onion and garlic. Absolutely delicious. Okay. Ah! I almost chopped my finger off. Anyways, um, now that my onions kind of look like little slices, these girls, I'm actually going to chop them, not finely, but like, you know, just like little tiny baby squares, but not like super tiny because we don't have time for that. And um, however it comes out, it comes out, you know. Um, yeah, I do this differently. Like the chopping differently, kind of. Girl, actually, let me stop chopping. Anyways, so this is how they look, like thinly. Um, yeah, I almost always do them like this, like um, little cubes. Um, the garlic is the only thing that I'm doing differently today. The garlic, I cut it like this too. So now that we have our two beautiful ingredients that never go missing, is my garlic and my onion, and we're just gonna pop it in the pan. So then we're going to like saute, I think that's the word, like in there. And it's like, it's gonna start smelling so delicious. I literally love the smell of garlic and onion just like cooking. It's beautiful. 
You can also add tomato. I don't add tomato, but tomato does make a difference. And like, I go crazy with like the little like ingredients that you want to put. Like sometimes I add cilantro. Um, today I'm not going to. I just I don't know. I'm not feeling very cilantro-ish. And yeah, another thing that I'm gonna add is um, peppers. Like um, I think they're serranos. Um, I don't know what these girls are, but I think they are serranos. They look like serrano peppers, right? Um, yeah, I add serranos. I'm gonna add... Because they're in this little bag. And I don't know. I think they're probably like spicy because they're not in the regular place where they always are. So I think they're like spicy. We're gonna add... Should we have one or two? Oh my god. Okay. Um, usually I add two. So I'm gonna add two today too. So, oh my gosh, it rained. Ah! And by the way, this is already starting to smell so good. Okay, so I'll be back. Now my little girls are washed. We're going to cut the little um, stem off. I think, I don't know the anatomy of a pepper, but yes. We're gonna cut this part off. Oh my gosh, this, I hate when knives are dull. Like, it's just like, oh my gosh, it literally, this one was one of my favorite because she was always so sharp. Um, the other thing is, I don't know how to sharpen a knife. Oh, I think this is gonna be spicy because it's already trying to like burn my finger. Um, yeah, I just, she was always so sharp, so that's why I got her because she's like my favorite. But right now that I was trying to cut the little stem off, she's getting dull. Oh yeah, did I say, I think, yeah, I don't know how to sharpen a knife. I think I just repeated myself and went in circles. <laughs> yeah, so, um, I was just talking to myself, honestly, when I was getting my ingredients and stuff. And I was like, what a perfect way to make a video right now. I would say I'm talking to myself right now too, but, like, I'm really not because I'm talking to you, you know what I mean? Like, I see you. Oh my gosh, she's getting dull and I hate it. Now that my little things are cooking over here, I'm gonna show you guys really quickly. Ta-ta. Yes, Um. now that they are frying or seasoning. Oh my gosh, yeah, so. I don't know why, another thing too, Um. as you can see, you're gonna be like, oh my god, they're burning. Again, don't follow it, to be honest, like, just kind of do it however you want to, because I personally, I like it kind of a little bit deeper, because it gives, like, a little toastiness, like, legit, which, it's like, it's burning, but it's like, I get, I've, got, I've gotten told that, um, a few times here, that they're like, your thing is burning, but I just like it like that. It's my personal preference. It's just like, you bite into it and it's like... Anyways, yeah. So next step is going to open up the little tuna cans. And this is like a really easy meal, but it's also really good. I really like it. Um, I was like, I want something to eat, but I, I don't know. I just like, I wanted something warm and this is warm, you know what I mean? Um, I would say that opening up the cans is like one of my least favorite part of doing this. That's why I don't like doing it that much. Well, actually, I do do it pretty often. But I just, ugh, I hate opening up the cans because it's like, girl, just open. Why do I have to be sitting here in a little, making this little circle so we can open up? Hmm. Those peppers are gonna be spicy because the air is getting kind of spicy. <gasps> no! And I also added some little like wax melts that are like um pumpkin. <clears throat> and and now it's gonna smell like spicy pumpkin. Ooh, I can feel it in my heart. You know when you spin it and it doesn't open all the way? And it's like so what were my efforts for? Okay, so one can is open. Let me open up the other one. Just keep breathing and breathing and breathing and breathing. No, I'll never be I'm gonna get a little spoon. And we're just gonna dump it in there.
We had to lower the heat, by the way. <laughs> okay. Now that we have lowered the heat, because we didn't do it all earlier, I'm sorry about that. Our second one. I am going to be starting to heat up my tortillas. Um, I really like the with tortillas, like making them into little tacos. Absolutely delicious. You can either leave it like this. I personally like to make another round of seasoning. So I'm going to add some salt and lemon pepper. I really like the flavor that lemon pepper gives to the tuna. And after, I'm going to add my most favorite seasoning, which is Maggi. And we're just going to like drizzle it in there. Just don't overdo it because um, it can get, if you add too much in it, it's going to get kind of salty. The pepper's making my nose tingle, but I feel like it's going to be so good. Like, oh my god, I cannot wait to eat it. Yes, and then we're going to add four tortillas. I'm thinking I'm probably going to eat five, so I'm going to eat right here because I'm going to heat you up. I'm going to put them away. <clears throat> and then I'm probably going to add some queso fresco. That sounds really good. So, yes, and we'll see you guys at the table. Mm, joking. Y'all, it's time to eat. It's hora de comer, it's hora de comer. Anyways, let me show you guys. Flavors. I just cannot. It's just once you feel that flavor hit your mouth, <laughs> levitation through the roof. I literally, I cannot. It's like it's so delicious. Like I literally. like beautiful it's amazing and it's so easy to make um, just everything and also the chili, it kind of hits like um, it's like I mean it isn't like in like um, it's spicy like it really enhances the flavor a lot. Like it, it's just like everything in here it just works together so well. Um.
guys have got to try this. It's absolutely delicious. So easy to make. And it's like, the only hard part is honestly opening up the cans. But overall, the, the, like, the, everything is so good. Like, ugh. Yeah, and add your own ingredients. You can add spinach. Sometimes I add spinach. Um, tomatoes. Add avocado. So this is a avocado in it too, just for like some texture. Um, I don't like avocados really because they're mushy. But yeah, and um, cilantro. Sometimes it also adds more flavor to it. Um, parsley. Yeah, you can eat it with rice. Also really good. I like it by itself and there's some cheese. And that's it. So thank you guys for watching and I'm gonna continue eating. And I'm gonna continue eating this beautiful masterpiece that I've been 